morning, I'm Echo and today I'm going to show you how to make Danish pancakes. In Denmark, pancakes are often flat, round and very thin. Traditionally, these pancakes are sprinkled with sugar, smeared with jam or served with some scoops of vanilla ice cream. These Nordic pancakes are super easy to make and you're gonna want to double or triple the recipe because these pancakes are absolutely delicious. There are many variants of pancakes around the world, but for me, Danish pancakes certainly tops the list of my favorite pancakes, all thanks to my Danish family who introduced me to this recipe. So, let's get started! Good morning! I'm Echo and welcome to Echo's Kitchen! Here are the ingredients. Milk, flour, eggs, melted butter, white and brown sugar, salt, and lemon zest. In a blender, add the milk, add the eggs, flour, sugar and salt. Put the lid on and blend. Use a spoon to scrape the flour stuck on the sides of the blender. Then, carefully add the melted butter. Blend well until the mixture is ultra smooth. Use a sift while transferring the mixture into a bowl. The mixture must be very thin and smooth. Cover with a plastic wrap and keep in the fridge for at least an hour. When you're ready to cook, add just a tiny bit of lemon zest onto the mixture if you like to add a very little citrus flavor to the recipe. This part of the process is totally optional. Mix again and set aside. Brush some butter into a pan over medium heat. When the pan is perfectly hot, ladle the mixture into the center of the pan and quickly lift and tilt and rotate the pan to coat the bottom evenly. Cook until the top surface of the pancake appears dry. Flip and cook for another 30 seconds or until the bottom is lightly golden brown. Transfer into a warm serving plate. Sprinkle the pancakes with sugar or with your desired filling, then roll up each pancakes. I love the subtle flavor and the softness of Danish pancakes. That is why I prefer to enjoy them the traditional way. The great thing about this recipe is that you can be creative and stir them like crepes. Smear some jam or top with some fresh berries and sugar icing or serve with some vanilla ice cream or whipped cream. I hope you'll try this recipe and let me know how it turns out. Serve immediately and as always, enjoy! Thank you for watching! If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. The complete list of ingredients is in the description box below. If you find my videos worthwhile, please like and follow my Facebook page and subscribe to my YouTube channel so I can continue to provide you with insightful videos and delicious recipes. If you have questions or suggestions, ideas, or a dish in mind that you would like me to make, please leave me a comment below. I would love to hear from you. Thank you for your support and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!